it's the crypto lightsaber back with another video guys so we're gonna do an update on squid grow this is a token that i spoke about um, about a month ago on the channel all right guys i want to show you this video as an example of how sellers get wrecked <laughs> all right guys sellers get wrecked in squid grow that's what i'm going to call this video sellers get wrecked in squid grow because squid grow has been going to the moon okay guys so you can look at this chart right here it's the one hour chart okay and uh, you can literally just see the tra the upward trajectory up and to the right on this particular mean coin right and um you know, I think this is this got the potential to do something like what Shiba Inu did, Dogecoin did, um, what's it, Doge Elon Mars and those sorts of coins because, I mean, the chart just paints a picture of the potential, right? Um, in a bear market, seeing a meme coin do something like this, right? It's a little bit more than a meme coin, actually. It's got staking and stuff like that. We'll look at, we'll, we'll take a look at that on the, uh, on the website. But uh, I spoke about this coin when it was like 300, 400k market cap, let's just uh, forward that a little bit so we can see the market cap. So it was 400k, 409k in market cap when I spoke about this token. And this is why I speak about a lot of these meme coins. People probably see me talking about a lot of this stuff. Um, they're not all bangers. They don't all work out. All right, guys, but every now and again, you get one that literally just, you know, makes you forget about all the other ones, right? At the end of the day, that's how venture capitalists work. They invest in almost everything, and you know their winners kind of make up for their losers, right, guys? Um, really, with a lot of these mean coins, you really shouldn't get a lot of losers because if you get in early enough. Uh, that being said, because a lot of times they do a pump out the gate anyway, right? If you're looking at this over here, I'm not even sure what the market cap started off at with this project, right? But even over here, it was sitting in massive gains, right? So. We made a profit on Squid Grow. Unfortunately, I decided to sell early. I mean, I am holding the token still, but I sold the token uh, pretty early. And um, yeah, it's just an example of sellers get wrecked because if we look at the market cap now, it's gone from 409K market cap from when I did that original video, right? To 14 million market cap. Now, one thing I will say is I still see this as potentially still super early. An example that I like to give is Doge Dash, right? So if we go to Doge Dash, this is one of my most famous calls, right, guys? I call Doge Dash. We could pull up the video, but um, I I did call Doge Dash at a hundred thousand in market cap, and this went to a peak of like three hundred million in market cap, and people made so much money on this particular token at the time. Um, it's come down now, but even now it's still sitting at over 5 million in market cap. All right, guys, so, you know, it's still super early, potentially, for Squid Grow, right, while it's in its hype phase. Okay, guys, <clears throat> and we know that coins like Shiba Inu and things like that have gone to over a billion uh, and so on, multiples of the billions, actually. Squid Grow is actually on coin market cap, and it's also listed on a few exchanges as well. So if we just pull that up on coin market cap, right squid grow you can see the chart over here um the market cap does differ on coin market cap i believe it's fully diluted at about 40 million at the moment this needs to be updated but sitting at about 8.3 million in market cap and it's listed on bitmar exchange open ocean and bkex and as well as pancake swap all right guys so these guys are busy these guys are busy and there's probably a reason behind the success of this project um, the developer is this guy, Shib Toshi, right? Uh, Shib Toshi. He's a billionaire. I did mention this in the previous video. He's one of the top Shiba Inu whales, right? And um, this is what they're using to market this. They're doing it. Well, he's doing AMAs and things like that. I saw a video from another guy yesterday. He was talking about the fact that, you know, um, BitBoy was coming at him and you know, this guy was, you know, talking about, you know, he doesn't have the rights to Squid Game and, and stuff like that. And, you know, uh, Netflix is going to sue him. And he posted something like, why would Reed sue me, uh, the owner of Netflix? Um, you have no clue. And he, he actually is it's almost like he knows the owner of Netflix and so on. So there's just a lot of smoke and mirrors and a lot of uh, stuff going on about this project. That's just making it bullish. And, you know, people like that sort of stuff, right? It's just, it's giving it that extra added effect of mystery and you know what if right because if we i'm trying to look for some of the um 
some of the uh, little screenshots that they've got of this guy like getting his diamonds tested and all that sort of stuff. In fact, I posted something about it in my Telegram group. If I just look for it, um, I could probably show you a screenshot of this guy's portfolio. Right, so this is it right here. He was getting this ring tested, right? But you can see his portfolio right here, right? Um, if this is real, <laughs> it looks real. But um, yeah, this guy's one of the top Shiba Inu whales, one of the earliest Shiba Inu holders, apparently. And uh, you can see his account, right? It's worth billions, right? We've got a $66 million, sorry, a $1.8 billion account right here. You can see Shiba Inu holders at 21 million and so on. So, you know, this guy's got, you know, he's got a bit of money behind him, right? And it seems like he's got contacts. Okay, guys, so, you know, uh, I'm not sure what was going on with BitBoy with all, all of that stuff. I'm not sure if I, I can even find it on Twitter, actually. If I just uh, go to the uh, Squid Grow Twitter. And, and, of course, you guys have to do your own research, right? But uh, one thing is for sure is that this token is making a lot of noise right now. And it's bullish. It's probably the top performing um, meme coin at the moment, right? Uh, they got listed on coin market cap just yesterday obviously i just showed you that anyway right so let's just go to uh have they got partnerships oh look they're getting partnerships didn't see that this is the first time i've been on the twitter myself actually um but if we go to uh the uh what's, what's it called shibtoshi uh, it's called at shibtoshi i just saw his handle a minute ago um, if we go to his Twitter, is it this one? Yeah, so it's this one right here, right? Um, this is a recent Twitter that he's just set up, apparently. But um, it's probably not on here. Yeah, this is the video that I saw from Safe Moon Joe. He does a pretty good job of uh, breaking down, you know, the um, the tweets from Bitcoin and stuff like that. In fact, let's just click on the video and see if we can find it for the sake of this video. But I just had to cut the ads for copyright purposes. Okay, guys, but if we try and find um, some of these tweets, right, without me having to... Right, so you've got this, right? So BitBoy Crypto News. So let me get this right. Lost money in the bear market, so you made a meme coin that does nothing of value, but perhaps one of your biggest errors besides the Ponzinomics. You don't own the IP for Squid Game, so you can't use its likeness at Netflix. It's going to sue you. That's from BitBoy Crypto News. I don't know if that's BitBoy himself. It could be someone representing the BitBoy team. And then you have Shibtoshi. He says, why would Reed sue me? LOL, he wouldn't. You have no clue. And then he added Reed Hastings, who is the CEO of Netflix. So it's almost like, you know, this is contributing to the uh, the pumpage, right? Or the, the mystery behind this Shibtoshi guy, right? And it's not like he's hiding, right? He's doing AMAs. He's, uh, he's active in the Telegram and so on. But I just think it's interesting, right? So, um, yeah, for me personally, you know, I have been buying more of this token and averaging in. And it looks like it's getting ready to fly again, right? Um, you know, it's just one of those ones where you just never know. All right, guys, would this hit 200, 300 million market cap, a billion? Right about now, it looks like the only one that I will be looking at as, as potentially doing that right now in the mean coin space. And, um, you know, I called this at like 400k now. I didn't know that this was going to do so well. All right, guys. In fact, at the time, I was talking about Squid Game 2.0, and then I, I got hit up with Squid Grow by, uh, you know, someone representing the team, I think. And, um, you know, I just thought it was just another meme coin. However, if we go to the website, right, um, I did like the website and the fact that it had staking from the very beginning. You can actually get some pretty decent APY. If you just stake your Squid Grow, you can get 50%. Um, but if you pair it up with Cake, you can get 500%. All right, guys. So that's about 1.3, a little bit more than 1.3% a day, maybe 1.36% a day. Okay, guys. So, um, yeah, you can actually pair that up and get some yield on that. All right, guys. So if this is a huddle for you, potentially you can actually increase your bag by a pretty significant amount, right? Um, so, yeah, I think this could be potentially uh, a good long-term hold 
all right guys they have updated the website since you've got um this guy riley you've got ship toshi um two of the main team members and they're doing a pretty good job at marketing this thing all right guys and we've not even seen a huge video rollout on this project okay so I know they're doing uh, quite a few Twitter and Telegram calls. I know they've got partnership with a few Twitter callers as well, um, which I saw online. But um, yeah, I had to do an update on this on this because you know it's it can't be ignored, right? This cannot be ignored. So yeah, I mean, sellers get wrecked. <laughs> we've seen that we see that going around in Telegram a lot, Twitter or whatever. Sellers get wrecked, okay guys, I call this way over here, and sold way too early, okay guys, but it is what it is, you win some, you lose some, I'm not perfect, far from it, but um, yeah, it's flying to the moon now, and we're sitting in a profit, so at the end of the day, the problem that you're going to have with this is when do you sell, okay, because you know, it could just continue to keep leaving you behind, but if you got in down here, no one could blame you for selling over here, for selling over here, for selling it even here right now, or for selling on the initial pump, because at the end of the day, you never know. But uh, a lesson to be learned from this is always leave something hanging, leave something in, maybe scale out, you know, a nice bit of profit, and leave something in just to see whether it continues. And that's only if you believe in the project. Okay, guys, Squid Grow is not one that I was looking at like it was a, you know, it was going to be the next big thing at the time, but uh, it's got my attention now. And I'm sure it's got a lot of other people's attention as well. So you guys can do your own research. Go and check out the website. Check out the tokenomics. It's 8% in, 8% out. And um, yeah, I mean, one thing's for sure is if this guy, right, if we go back to his, uh, that screenshot, right? Where is it? In Telegram, right? If this guy is able to huddle, right, all this, I mean, you don't expect any sort of dump on this token anytime soon if this guy's still holding shiba inu from way back then yeah apparently um what he said was that um he's, he's not doing this to make money apparently he's doing it for other people right he's doing it for people to, to get a chance and uh, let me see um let me just type for people <clears throat> let's see if we can find the um quote what he said about it oh, let's just go ship toshi um let's see okay i can't find it all right guys but um Let's just go to this one. It says, our owner, Shib Toshi, is a top holder at Shib, and he has made billions in the crypto world. He's decided to give back to the crypto community by creating this project. He's not here to pump the chart. He specifically said he wants to build a community and help everyday investors make money. How high will we go? 100 million, 1 billion, 10 billion, no one knows. But with an owner like this, anything is possible. We developed a culture and conviction with our community. Ship Toshi has done several AMAs explaining the way and what crypto is supposed to be about. It took Ship Toshi 400 days to become a billionaire. He knows the way. Buy, hold, shill. Buy the dip, hold and wait for 1 billion market cap or more. We have three utilities, two major central exchange listings and Neopro is assisting with marketing. They helped Moon, Baby Doge and SFM welcome home. Can you hold for 400 days if it allowed you to make $1 million? So... There you have it, guys. Let me know what you're thinking in the, in the, in the comments. Um, tick the little bell for notifications. Like the video. That helps with the YouTube algorithm. And I'll see you guys in the next video.